Tony King, a former employee of the Beatles record label Apple, did not specifically say that the label was mad. However, it's important to note that the Beatles' venture into the world of Apple Corps, their multimedia corporation, faced numerous challenges and difficulties. Apple Corps was established by the Beatles in 1968 as a mean to manage their business affairs, including their record releases, film projects, and other creative endeavors. However, the label faced various financial and legal issues, including lawsuits and mismanagement. While the label encountered challenges, it's also worth mentioning that Apple Corps released several successful albums by the Beatles during their time together, including the White Album, Abbey Road, and Let It Be. The label also provided a platform for other artists such as James Taylor, Badfinger, and although it struggled to replicate the Beatles' success with its other signings, overall, while the Beatles' Apple label faced its share of difficulties and complexities, characterizing it as mad is not an accurate portrayal. It was a significant part of the Beatles' legacy and contributed to their musical output, even though the label was faced with its fair share of challenges.